so we post those, we post the videos of the uh, bolt bags. Number one, mm -hmm. we're spinning out here. So the newer, newer it's still, uh, still an older version. Kind of older, but it's I mean, it's older than the yeah. It's got thousand on first it. Part of it yeah. But it's closer. We've got, we've got some new um, air meshes and shit we're working with. We redid the shoulder pads. Um, it's all Velcro line. Guys keep asking what's inside. And really, it doesn't matter because they're not for sale. Um, we build these. And uh, guys that get them, they're just their preferred customers or their friends or they have something that we want to trade for. But it's all Velcro line. And this is something I had done in my bigger bags. And originally, the reason, original reason we did it was we had a foam kit that would go around. It was foam inside some thin material that would Velcro in here, which would give it its shape and foam the sides. And then there's a sleeve pocket here that goes all the way to the bottom. You can put a piece of foam in as there is in the face. So we can make the perimeter and the front and back all foam. And the pieces that went in had Velcro on them, so they would Velcro in. And then we had dividers that would go in so we could turn it into a camera kit or anything inside that we needed, you know, protected we could put inside it. It's got a drag handle, has a big punch cut out here uh, for comm wires or camelback tube or whatever you want to access through there. And then it has pals down the side. Just real simple. Um, but guys go ape shit over them every time we post them up. So this guy, Guitar Tony, on Instagram, he's shown up talking shit before. And he gets blasted and then fucking people, you know, hit him back and he just fucking, you never hear from him again. But he pops up again last night and I thought I'd recognize him. You got a bunch of dudes here going, wah, it's sexier than hell, blah, blah, blah. Still waiting. So Guitar Tony shows up. Maybe... We would all be able to buy this if SOE would make the cool tactical shit like this instead of those cocks. I wouldn't really call bright ass red fucking tactical. <laughs> tactical. Um, Multicam black. I built that because I wanted that back. That's why we built it. There's three more over there that are about 75% done, and there's six of them in multicam where all the bodies and everything are built, they just have to be put together. There's one up there, I started putting them together and forgot all the fucking attachment points. So there's a bag that's all seamed up. So Guitar Tony shows up and uh, then he said, he posts again in a row, still waiting on the modular bailout bag, John. No, you're not because it's never been on order. And if I know it's you, you will never fucking buy one. These, like, these aren't ever going on the website. I put these up on a closed private group they will sell immediately. If we put them up for auction, they'll go for $1,000. That's a lot for that fucking bag. You can go buy a bag of that shape and that size for probably $100 from other companies. Um, it'll be China. You can buy a good US one for probably 250 bucks. They will pay that. I will get $1,000 for these every time we build them. And if you don't like it, I don't know what to fucking tell you. Don't, don't buy it. I, I understand it. But fucking coming over and talking shit on my page is going to get you nowhere. So he says he's waiting for a bailout bag. Then he posts again, and a vehicle med bag. Then he posts again, and a Molly seat bag. And then he posts another dude post and says, What an incredible jet bag. I wonder what the point is, though, of posting pictures of your products that are not available to purchase. Are any SOE bags going to be produced again? Well, it's like Ferrari. Ferrari puts up photos like the La Ferraria. To have been able to buy one of those, you were invited to buy one. You have to have been a previous, you have to have bought a Ferrari from Ferrari already. Not secondary market. You had to buy a new one at a dealership in order to get invited to buy the new one. It's the same thing. You're not going to go over there and give them shit about it. Right. It's the same fucking thing. If you don't like how I'm running, I do that because I got that idea from Ferrari. We can more than sell everything we build. I don't want to put a fucking Ford in everybody's driveway. It's like KTM motorcycles. How many motorcycles does KTM want to build? One less than they can sell every year. You don't walk into a dealership for KTM and find fucking last year's bike on clearance or on sale. You can go buy fucking, we were buying Hondas in 1991, we were buying 87 Hondas brand new in the crate from the dealership because they didn't sell. They built too many of them. So then this dude comes back, another dude, uh, Matthew, Matthew Wyron, uh, tags Guitar Tony and myself and says, clearly there's been a shift in focus in SOE. Hate to see them turn into a fucking lifestyle brand, but oh well, whatever makes money, I guess. Can't fault that. And then people are calling for a code in his name. And then he says, um, when you own your own company, 
you can build whatever you like and show the world. It's what the company can. It's what the. It's what the company can too. Do I think is what he meant. Haters gonna hate. Dumbasses skyline themselves. And then the dude comes back. Matt twenty two eight oh five. This is all Instagram. Tags this uh, beast beast mode 09, but it's spelled with zeros and shit. I'm very familiar with what this company can do. I love their products. I'm just amazed that some of their best products are never available to purchase where in 2012, 2013 they were. No, they weren't. That product has never, ever been for sale. And the reality is, go ahead and pan over here. Guys saying, are we ever going to build bags again? These are all bags that we're not going to sell to you. <laughs> like, you guys complaining, you will never get one of those bags. We're going to walk over here in a minute. we got a bunch of vehicle med bags cut. There's modular seat back panels over there cut. We're going to go through all those orders today, and we're going to find anybody named Tony or Anthony, because he says he has an order. And we're going to build those orders, and we're not going to ship your shit. Fucking eventually, you'll come forward and tell us who you are, and we'll refund you. Or you're just going to get fucking tired of waiting, and you're going to charge your credit card off so that you think we don't know. In which case, we'll fucking know who you are then, too. One way or another, you're not getting any fucking product from us that you ordered. So, fucking, you might as well just tell us who you are so we can cancel and refund your order. Because it's not fucking shipping. My guys are going to spend fucking two hours today going through all those open orders, and everybody that has those on order, it's about to be their lucky day, because we're going to expedite that shit just from you talking shit, just so we cannot send your shit to you. Um, but the reality of it is, micro rigs, slings, and belts, we could shut down all the other shit we build probably and be more profitable. Oh, yeah. We literally cannot build enough slings. Nope. We built 120 slings yesterday, there's probably 40 still sitting here right now. That just because they haven't pulled the orders from this morning. Um, micro rigs, we're running 120 coyote? 120 coyote. Um, some dude, that was some dude talking shit too. Yeah. Some dude talking shit, I don't even remember what it was last week. So we went ahead and expedited all those. Um, we built extras in there. We're going to do a, a buy now, ship now code or do something else. We had a guy, um, oh, I found out you're a felon. I don't want to support you. Cancel my order. So we canceled his OD order. Just found it. And, and it's because he was pissed He was pissed that he had to wait. He had waited a week when it said 8 to 12 weeks. And really, the micro race said no um, ETA on them. So we built all those OD ones. We put $100 in one of them, 50 in another. 50. You put $100 in two of them. Yeah. Did we? Yeah. yeah, and then 50 and 50. That's right, because somebody was talking shit. I'll bet they fucking pulled that money out of there yeah. after they turned the camera off. We sold 35 of them in seven, 17 minutes, and 50 of them had sold by 20 minutes. And uh, we shipped all those out. But like belts, I mean, pan pan over. These are these are just belts we happen to have sitting here right now. We have. And don't don't fucking ask me if we have your size. When you order, it's when my guys are able. To, even if you order today, they have a stack of orders ahead of you, and we got four dudes back here pulling orders. But like. We just happen to have these because we just built a bunch of 32s. We just built a bunch of 40s. We just built a bunch of 32s, 36s, 38s. We have these because the girls built extras in them yesterday. We took all the orders for that size, cut 24 extra. That's why we have them. But that's what we're busy building. And those will be gone by the end of the day. That's right. A good chunk of them. 36s, 42s. I mean, so as far as you know, tactical shit, it is what it is. If you don't like how we do business, start your own fucking business. If you don't want to support us, don't support us. There's fucking plenty of guys that do. I mean, these are these are all orders that were fucking pulled this morning that Dakota's about to ship. There's two rows on most of those. These are boxes we make up. When Sebastian gets home from school, he fills all these up. These two racks, and these are this third rack. I'll go through With these small flat rate boxes. We, we'll use every one of these boxes yeah. we filled today. Those will go out of here. So... We're busy doing what we do, but let's, so. That's all cut work. That's all bags. Bags, bags, bags. All that shit on the shelf, that's all cut work. Somewhere on there, don't zoom in on those tags. Somewhere on there are the vehicle med bags and somewhere up there are your seat back panels. Our guys are going to pull that down and we're going to find anybody named Tony and anybody named Anthony or anything like that 
and we're gonna pull those orders out. So when you get tired of, if your name's Tony or Anthony, fucking send us an email and tell us you're not that asshole, and send us a link to your Instagram so we know it's not you, and you will be precluded from that. But that's it. You can turn that shit off. That should be enough to fucking stir them up. Yeah. That's